Hello, and this is just the test recording. So this is my, uh, my current save. So let's see how it goes. Okay, so just completed the mission, so now we're heading back to Ogna. Hopefully we're not going to get attacked by the dire wolves. Although that's always a possibility. Just to level up Edelmar. Right, so we'll give him some points in Resolve. Uh, hit points and uh, melee defense. Beautiful. And then as a perk. Let's see, what's he good at? What, uh, what does he need? I think if we give him some uh, fast adaption, that'll be good. Radalf the younger leans back in his chair, folding his hands over his lap. Cell swords don't sit right with many folks, I suppose, on account of your killing and destroying whole villages. On a short changed whim, but I'll admit you've done good. He nods to a corner of the room where the wooden chest lays unopened. It's all there, but I won't be offended if you need to count it. You do count it, and it is indeed all there. Beautiful. Right, I'm gonna do a sneaky scum save. Because, uh, yes, this game is very unfair. And I don't want to ruin my video. Right, we will take this contract. You find Radolf the Younger reading a scroll. He throws the paper at you and asks you to read off the names. The handwriting is difficult, but not more so than the names themselves. You stop and apologise, stating that you are not from these parts. The man nods and takes the scroll back. Tis alright, sword. If you were wondering, those were the names of men, women and children who have passed in the last week. Last week, those were a lot of names on that list. The man seeming to read you nods somberly. Aye, we are in a bad way, so many lives lost. We believe this to be the work of foul creatures, beasts beyond our ability to reason. Obviously, we'd like you to go and find and destroy them. Would you be interested in such a task, mercenary? What's this worth to you? He jingles a bag of coins. This will be yours if you help us out on this. You are to receive 420 crowns when the contract is done. 420. We need to be paid more for this. Very well. Given your demands, I offer you this. It's a 450 crown when the... <laughs> it's 450 crowns when the contract is done. I accept your offer. Okay, so we need to hunt down what terrorises Ogna. Let's go. I think we got this one in the bags. In the bag. Just uh, quickly hire another meat shield. I think, what do we need? Could use another archer. Rabin. Your time has come, mate. Your time has come. Okay, he's a Spartan character, which means that... Uh, he, he doesn't take up as much uh, provisions and doesn't really care about food that much. Fantastic. Right. Okay, we're hunting down what terrorizes Ogna. Right. Okay. Those bloody dire wolves that we saw earlier on. Glad we didn't attack them then. 
like uh, the Joker said, if you're good at something, never do it for free. Okay, game time. Fork. You need to exercise more, mate. Okay, come on, archers. If we can kill one of them, that will hopefully scare the rest. Good man, Janald. Good man. Right, uh, hard. Let's go. Good man. So he stunned that dire wolf, which means that he can act in the next turn. Uh, Rabin, the new guy, had to mess it up. Okay, I think we're going to need more people down at the bottom here. Oh, let's... Okay, fingers crossed. Shit, shit. Bastard ate Erhard's hat. Right, so we're just going to put a repost on, which means that we can have a chance to counter-attack any attack on us. And then... Right, this one is fleeing now. Okay, let's bring Meinholf forward a little bit. Oh, Meinholf, you've, you've let the team down, mate. Good man. Baldwin. 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 Okay, can we? Can you hit anyone from here without hitting one of your mates? Doesn't look like it. Right, you go over here. Uh, and you can go over here. not a good idea. Okay. Compared to Mountain Blade this is quite stressful because uh, any mistake that you make could spell a permanent end of one of your team which is quite a disturbing thought. Erhard is the, the MVP at the moment. Exactly what can happen. Fortunately, no. When we when we go after these contracts, there's always a chance that that'll happen. Just 
every miss is a potential death. Stupid fuckers are suicidal it looks like. Right, good, so two of them are fleeing, we've only got two left to deal with for now. Burhard, mate, you just finish them off. Okay, it's just uh, this one is fleeing as well now, so we only need to worry about this one. Uh, they can, uh, they can have morale checks, which means that they can come back into the fight if their side seems to be doing a lot better, but we can manage it, injure this one quickly enough, it won't be a problem. Good. Everyone's acting as a team now. Okay, right, it's pretty much over at this point, it's just the... Uh... <laughs> well, we did say that we would hunt them down, so... Right, we've got to run them down. You know, not to mention that they did attack us. Beautiful. Right, so Bolduin and Bjorn have leveled up. Bork the Wanted has expired, which is a shame because we... He was actually a murderer and we rehabilitated him quite well into the company as a professional murderer, I think. Right, Loop, take all of that. Your employer, Radalf the Younger, might not believe what happened here without evidence. You order the men to begin taking pelts, trophies, scalps, whatever might show off your victory here. Let's be done with this, we have crowns to collect. Beautiful. Okay, right, I will end the recording here.